This is This is Unboxing Unboxing Video Video Let's go Let's go So today we're gonna unbox this camping stove from Shopee Which I got like two days ago So let's go Redbird portable stove. Pretty decent. So it says here outdoors camping. Gross weight is like 500 grams, so it's like half a kilo. Net weight 416 grams. Automatic uh, electronic ignition. Nice. Mm, nice. User manual before assembly, operating the stove, disassembling the stove. Okay. Information for safety. Nice. So let's check this one out. So you have the stand here. So this is the ignition. I'm not sure if you can see it, but this stick right here is actually the one uh, that's igniting it. This is okay. Alright, so let's try this now. Again guys, this is uh, where you're gonna put the gas canister, that one. This is your flame adjuster. Make sure that it's always closed. And this is your igniter here. Alright. So, okay. I don't know if you noticed guys, but there are like two metal plates here. So just a quick tip, you actually need to uh, put or fit in the, the gas canister on the lower part first before you actually screw in on the upper part. So do it like this and then you screw it in and that's it. Make sure it's closed and then yep. <laughs> Alright, so before you start using this, you always need to, to check if the, the stove, this one, is properly connected to the gas cartridge in a, in a gas tight fashion, showing no leakage or whatsoever. And then before lighting the stove or the burner, you just have to place the, the stove in a, in a firm level surface, make sure it's flat, and ensure that the pan supports, these are the pan supports by the way, this one's. So you need to make sure that the pan supports are fully opened out in the, the cooking position. Then after that, you just have to open uh, this flame adjuster here, like very slowly. You just have to wait for that hissing sound. That one. And then you just have to press the igniter. There. 
And then if it's too strong, you just have to adjust it from here. And then of course, uh, once you're done using it, you just have to adjust the flame adjuster again. Uh, just have to turn it off. And then before you disassemble it, you, ask, you actually just have to wait for the stove to cool down. Then once the, the stove cool down, you just have to disassemble it. Again, you just have to twist it like this. Then remove it. First thing you need to do is you need to fold uh, these, uh, what I call this, uh, pan support. So I just have to flip it. And then this one too. And just put it back uh, to the storage bag. So for our verdict, it's definitely a good product for the price of $3. I, I use my free shipping voucher in this one. It has a five kilogram max weight capacity, so that's all good. Um, it, it's very compact, it's, it's, it's lightweight, it's so easy to carry, so yeah, it's a good buy. In case you also want one, um, I will post the link below. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, and see you on the next video. Have a nice day, bye.